Alright, in the previous video I talked about a few simple tricks, everyone knows them, but only the chosen one know that they can be done continuously. And if you watched that video, my congratulations. In this video I will show you tricks that every self-respecting pen spinner can do at least 2-3 times. These are the most popular and well-known continuous pen spinning tricks, but not the easiest ones. Not at all. My personal record for the most mastered one is 8 rotations maximum. On the other hand, there are people who manage to do them more than 1000 times, and sometimes it is not even limited to that. Very impressive. I have no idea why I can't do that. Because doing them is quite fun, and they look so amazing that it makes surrounding people's jaws drop in surprise. Moreover, they are great in finishers for any combo, and overall, they are great time killers. After watching this video, write in the comment what are your results for each trick at the moment, and in a few months we will come back here together and see how much progress we have made. I have conditionally arranged the tricks from the list by their popularity. And first, of course, will be busts. Pay attention to middle finger which does the main work, since it is the one that throws pen mode up to perform a new turn, while well, the index finger, which is the focus of the audience's attention, does almost nothing. Its main task is just stick out and not get in the way. Second in popularity I consider to be th continuous thumb around, although in reality of course it is fingerless thumb around. To do it continuously you use the same principle as for busts, by slightly flicking it up in a thumb flap for each new rotation. In this trick the thumb plays a bigger role, it moves with the pen to help it rotate. What's the most thumb rounds you can do? For me it is currently 8 rotations, the maximum for both, busts and thumb rounds. I confess, it's embarrassing. If you don't want to feel as embarrassed, consider getting a good pen mod. There is a referral link to a store for pen spinners in the video description. I think it is the best store on the market today, with worldwide delivery as well. Register users get a super discount, but only for now, so don't hesitate. Ok, we continue with continuous middle knee back. It is usually less popular than the previous big tricks, but it is a really cool trick and doing it continuously is incredibly fun. I like this trick so much that I can do it up to… 3-4 uh, times. Here we need to carefully watch that in this position the middle finger is closer to this end of the mod. That's why before the turn I sort of let the pen slide down the finger a little. And that perhaps is the main difficulty and the challenge of the trick. Well, also the fact that it is a top spin and it is harder to control. Yep, I find million excuses for my clumsiness. Because the next step is pinky spread. And here I can't boast any special successes. Once in a blue moon I managed to do three spreads, but usually it's limited to two. Although I'll let you in a little secret. The trick looks much harder than it actually is. We start with power pass, because spread is essentially its continuation. To toss the pen mode up, you need to bend your pinky finger, just like you bend the other fingers in power pass. Don't try to throw the mode as high as possible, it should fly up to a height that is just enough for you to straighten pinky finger and not much more than that. The most important thing is try to land the mod slightly away from its center, not on the edge, but slightly towards that side. I have detailed tutorials for all the mentioned tricks, so if you don't know how to do any of them, be my guest. I wish you good luck in your pen spinning journey. Cheers.